Hello everyone, this is Adrian from CH. Uh, today we have a Sado FG36 that it's been uh, converted uh, to run on the CH CDI. Okay, the, this engine actually, this uh, Sado FG20, 30 and 36, they come with the original Sado ignition that it has here, the sensor right at right here on the bottom is the round one okay so uh, what we've done we made an adapter that uh, fits right into the spot where the all the sensor used to go one of the things uh, this rib right here it has to be grinded down like the one here and uh, time at 30 degrees before top dead center so uh, the prop it's a APC 18.6 wide exactly like uh, it says on the Horizon Hobby site. So let's give it a quick try. Okay, I went a little bit too low with it. As you see, it starts easy. <laughs> yeah, and by the time I get to throttle it a little bit, So on the side it says that with this prop it gets 8300 RPM. Right here on the stand it's getting 84 plus. So yeah, around 1300, it's the right RPM, I'm trying to go as slow as possible. Yeah, it's way too low. I have not tuned it at all, I just uh, put it on the stand, exactly how I got it from the customer. So probably if I will play with it I might get a little bit, or I might lose a little bit RPMs, never know. So 
then again that was just a quick video on the pretty much evening okay so here is where the sensor gets it gets mounted exactly in the same place where the original it was okay so right there uses the same two bolts and this uh, sensor holder it works for the Sado FG20 uh, on that one you have on that engine you have to use the two little spacers that they are under the original sensor on the FG30 you don't have to do anything it just goes exactly like this one and might have to work out a little bit the way it's here to get the 30 degrees before top that center a little bit filing here and there might be required but for those that they have those uh, ignitions and uh, get out of it I'm sure that uh, after so many years you cannot find those anymore but uh, we have the sensor adapter and actually Bill Carpenter had this for a very long time so when I took over I just made it more so this is the Sado FG36 running with CH ignition sensor CDI conversion. Also I have uh, the carburetor adapter for uh, some, some people actually call and say that they have some problems with this carburetor when they turn or they bank left or right I don't remember. The carburetor is different than this what it requires to cut the flange right there on the bottom right 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 there yeah just let me pause it a second and i will bring one so you can see what i'm talking about okay here i'm back so this is just the adapter the carburetor gets mounted on this side like you know normal so what it requires to be done this flange here to be cut really really close and maybe touch with a file here so then this part it goes right here like that okay so it gets in the same place pretty much it gets up and it has two set screws before you put it in it's uh, good if you put some maybe JB weld or some uh, RTV to seal it better it goes in you put it in a position where it's better for your throttle and then you tie the set screws, let it set, and uh, so far with uh, with those modification, it didn't have uh, any complaints about the way it runs. Actually, they was happy that the engine didn't stop. So then again, this is the Sado FG36. Same adapter goes for the 30. Okay, so sensor modification and carburetor modification if you want to change the carb if you have issues with it um, that will be it guys thank you so much for watching and come back for more